Dr. Colleen Fogarty, the department chair at uh, Highland Family Medicine, is back with us. Always good to see you, doctor. Good morning, Mark. So we're talking about libraries today and how they yeah. can impact our health. Let's yes. start right there. Uh, how are libraries a source of good health? So libraries are a free public resource that we can obtain lots of information. So we talk about the importance of children reading for their knowledge and their health. And then for adults, we can get any kind of information we want, particularly things about health and nutrition. Uh, librarians are a great resource to find reliable information that can help us live more healthy. And enjoyment, too. There's things to do for entertainment that are free and terrific. And there's a social aspect of going to the library as well, Absolutely. as opposed to just sitting in your house and looking at information as well, right? Absolutely. Librarians and the staff at libraries have um, story time for smaller children. There's events for teenagers. Oftentimes there are free movie showings or other kinds of community talks that would be of interest. You mentioned it's free, and that's a great thing. All you got to yeah. do is what? Uh, show uh, ID to show proof verify of address. county right. resident, mm -hmm. right? Okay. Uh, and there's this new thing, and I don't know how new it is, but it's kind of cool. There's a statewide library card, right? So New York City Public Library is available to any resident of New York State. And with the advent of electronic books and audiobooks, it's a great resource. You can sign up for a library card through their website, and then you can have access to electronic books to read on your e-reader or phone, or audiobooks to listen when you're driving or out walking or whatever. Right, and when we think about the library, you can literally take it with you wherever you go. You can go. take it with you, that's right. Uh, and if they, they may have a book that we don't have here, and you have the access that's to right, it. That's right, that's uh, right. You know, libraries are a great gathering place, as we said. Uh, to that end, there is a menopause awareness talk that is going on today. Tell right. us about that. That's right. The Center for Community Health out of the University of Rochester has a monthly series of health-related talks downtown at the public library in the Kate Gleason Auditorium. Today it'll be at 1210, a women's health nurse practitioner talking about menopause matters. We'll show the website so you can see the schedule for the remainder of the year. But that's an excellent way to go get some good information from a reliable health care practitioner and perhaps connect with some others about your topic of interest. That's great. Uh, doctor, thank you. So libraries and good health, they go hat in hand. Appreciate uh, the knowledge and the insight as always. Uh, she mentioned that link. We will share that on our website and more in our conversation about libraries and good health posted at rochesterfirst.com.